Hey YouTube, Terry McClellan here, first from the line. How are you guys doing today? Just heading out on the line today. I uh, thought I'd make a little video just of uh, what's been up. Um, there's my sleigh that I had to, I'm putting new runners on. Uh, there's one was still in good shape, but there was there's two more on it, and the, the other two were pretty rough. Uh, I had some pieces here. I don't know what I did with them, but anyways, it doesn't matter. That's irrelevant. Um, yeah, so that's a sleigh that I'm fixing right now. I'm thinking about putting a box in there because that new sled of, of mine throws lots of snow inside of the inside of the sleigh. That new uh, skidoo I bought. So I'm uh, I'm thinking about putting a box inside this thing. Um, we'll see. Anyways, so yeah, so I'm doing that and I was fixing up uh, Wolverine boxes. I got all kinds of scrap wood. Got the saw set up. My uh, my snow plow and everything. We haven't had snow. Knock on wood. We haven't had snow in about uh, at least going on two weeks, maybe three weeks. So I haven't been. I haven't had to use it, but I keep it inside here so it starts. You know, I went uh, elk hunting this year, and there was lots of bears where we went. I just had that. I just bought this thing and had that seat was redone, and those dirty buggers overnight come and rip that seat off that skidoo or off that uh, quad of mine. Uh, but it is what it is. I'll get it fixed. I got a guy in town fix some. But yeah, so I'm just doing a little bit of this, a little bit of that. This little fox here was brought to me in that Sorel box over there. I don't know if you can see that. Somebody hit him on the highway. He was, he's young. His hair is not bad. He's not great, but I'm going to skin him out anyway. I'm, I got a plan for him. If he's in not bad shape in the hair wise, I'm going to see if I can get, there's a local lady in town that does some tanning. I might get her to tan that. And uh, I'm gonna thinking about putting it on a coat for my granddaughter, but we'll see. We'll see what the hair looks like when it's all done. And then, yeah, so other than that, there's my Martin. I'm getting a few. Uh, it's been slow, but I'm getting a couple. That one there has been, was from last year, was eaten. I just threw it in there. It's got a nice, the, the back fur on it is just beautiful, big, large Martin, but the top and the side got eaten by Mr. I think it was Mr. Wolverine or Mr. Lynx. But anyways, yeah, and there's another one there that I got. So yeah, so I'm getting a few. Like I say, we don't got I don't got a lot of Martin here, but it is what it is. And then this Lynx I caught late last year. I didn't get him to the sale, but he's uh, he's there and ready to go. I uh, I inherited a couple of these uh, these uh, cardboard boxes. I don't know if I'm going to try them, but anyways, somebody had bought them and they left them behind and then the, when they were cleaning up the hall from the cell last year somebody said hey would you use these and I said oh, I'll give them a try so I I took this one and I I taped it all up because it was all in pretty bad shape I taped it all up to see and that sort of gives me the size to build it too so I built one the other day and I'm going to put it in the bush and just see how I like it and go from there but yeah I just thought I'd give you a little update on that um got my mitts and everything ready to go bait and everything's outside uh yeah, everything everything seems fine. Uh, sl trapping slow, well, not slow. I just gotta just gotta get out there and get more traps in the bush, and I'll probably come home with some fur. Uh, flying squirrels like crazy this year. I can't believe it. Um, a friend of mine, Scotty, says to me one day. He says, "Hey, Terry. He says, why don't you um, why don't you uh, make some videos?" I said, "Well, you know, they're not very interesting when you catch four flying squirrels." I said, "People will lose interest in your videos pretty quick." <laughs> but yeah so I'm gonna go out today and I'll make a I'll make you guys a video of a catch um, just how I set it up and this and that and then um, I'll throw that on online later too uh, but uh, yeah I appreciate peep comments and stuff from people and uh, uh, hopefully I get some more fur and I can make it I gotta I gotta buy a new camera so right now I'm doing everything off my uh, cell phone and it's working but I gotta get to a cell phone pro and ask them how i can combine these videos and i don't know if you can on a cell phone but anyways that's a question i have for i have a friend that's pretty good on cell phones if i can take two or three videos four or five minute videos and make a 15 minute clip if i can do that then i would i would uh i would make that all uh like i'd make longer videos for you guys to watch with like i'll make a catch minute long and then i'll make another catch and i'll show you all my catches in the day but on a cell phone i don't know if you can do that but anyways as for that goes sorry for the bouncing um i'm gonna head out now i'm heading out on the line i gotta go get some gas and then i'm out of here uh oh yeah i was gonna show you guys this nice nice chocolate lady here just black 
Yeah, I caught her the I caught her the other day. She's a nice black one. Nice black Martin. But yeah, so uh, I'm gonna let you guys go and we'll talk to you guys later. Thank you very much for watching my videos. First from the line and see you down the line. Have a good Sunday.